China and the United States concluded their annual trade talks, dubbed the Joint Commission on Commerce and Trade, on Friday, with both sides agreeing to remove trade barriers and building a foundation for a new model of development. Well, to better explain the significance of the Commission, US Secretary of Commerce Penny Pritzker sat down with CCTV News and she also talked about bilateral investment between China and the US. I think you have to step back and recognize that the relationship between the United States and China is one that is extremely important to both countries. And so the JCCT is a mechanism by which it's an, it, there's processes that go on and meetings that go on all year long. And it's a way for us to talk about and to resolve economic issues, macro issues, as well as specific issues that are, can enable companies to be able to do business uh, both in the United States and in China. So it's a very important dialogue that culminates with this meeting that we have here. My first trip to China was in 1984. And so I've seen uh, all the progress and great achievements that have occurred firsthand over the last 30 years uh, in China. And for me, when I look at our uh, relationship and the dialogue that we've had, I see that as years go by, the issues that we need to address change. And so it's very important that we have this relationship, uh, this mechanism for conversation, but it's also important to the United States that uh, the dialogue is very fresh. And one of the things that was so exciting or, or good about this meeting was the fact that our relationship could, the relationship between the three principals, the three co-chairs, could uh, evolve and become further established. And Vice Premier Wan Yang really did a terrific job of leading the meeting and uh, raising important issues for both countries and helping us then to guide us through the process of reaching uh, some of the resolutions that we've put out today. America is definitely open for business and in fact uh, China had its largest investment year ever in its history this year uh, as well as China sent to the United States we had our first ever Select USA Summit where we promote foreign direct investment into the United States. China sent the largest delegation of any country and we welcomed those companies and it helped introduce them to the 47 different states had their economic development officers at our Select USA Summit. And we worked with those companies to help them to meet the different states and cities so that they could do a business and find a place to make their investments here in the United States. So we're facilitating that uh, uh, very much.